I'm Madeline Bailey and this is a photo of me when I was in kindergarten. I was a total tomboy growing up and even now I don't love wearing makeup. Madeline, thank you so much for being here with me today. Thank you for having me. Why did you start wearing makeup? When I started YouTube, I wasn't wearing makeup. And I was like, oh no, that camera is like focused on my face. And yep. people are just like examining and dissecting. And they're like, oh, you have a, you have a crooked tooth. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I didn't know. I've never looked <laughs> in the mirror and noticed that I have a crooked tooth. How does social media affect your views towards makeup? Yeah, I remember one picture in particular. It was in the middle of summer in Wisconsin. I had an awesome day, I went swimming, and obviously I'm not gonna be wearing makeup when I'm swimming. And so I just took like a picture of me and I just wanted to show people how happy I was and how fun it was today to just like let loose and not wear makeup and be free and feel good about myself. And then I went back to the photo the day after and I was so disappointed by by the, the amount of people who criticized me for the first time that like I didn't look perfect, the first time that I posted a picture without makeup, they just ripped me apart. Of course there were fans who also defended me, but mm -hmm. I was just shocked that I couldn't have like a real human moment. So then what did you take away from that experience? Uh, I, for the biggest thing was just to not let those comments bother me, but to also like try to keep my audience accountable. Like when I called yeah. them out on it and I was like, hey guys, that's not cool the, to criticize me for the bit of acne that I had that day. Even though like you missed the whole point that I was trying to show you me feeling incredible about myself that day. And honestly, growing up, I feel like not wearing makeup was the best thing for me because I really got to know who I was as a person as opposed to like trying to be somebody for everybody else to look at. What advice do you have for people in terms of looking confident without makeup? A good piece of advice is to have a really good skincare regimen because if your skin is looking fresh and, and smooth and clean, you're probably not gonna feel like you have to wear makeup that day. Just surround yourself with a group of people who you don't feel like you need to wear makeup around. Like, I've never felt like I need to wear makeup around my husband, my best friends, and like when you can feel beautiful around people who really, really love you, then like I feel like you can, you can feel confident around anybody else. All right, Madeline, well thank you so much for being here today and for talking to thank the viewers about this. I think it's a really cool topic, and you know, you're beautiful, you have a great personality. Tell everybody where they can find you. I'm of course on YouTube, uh, Madeline Bailey on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and then I have a Snapchat, Ms. Mad Hatter, M-I-Z-Z. So cute, so cute. <laughs> Guys, as usual, comment in the comment section below. Let us know what your favorite part was of this interview. Let me know who you want to see on upcoming episodes and what topics you want us to tackle. The world is your oyster. We are here to bring you the topics that you want to see. As always, you can find me at Kirby Johnson on Instagram and Twitter and Baby Wody on Snapchat. You know who it is, Baby Wody. All right, um, subscribe to Pop Sugar Girls Guide and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.